Yeah, it's real cold out here today. Me and my boy out here. It's cold. These type of dogs are lightweight adapted to the cold. People say, we well, you supposed to keep them in the house. Why? Who's guarding who? You guarding him or he guarding you? But it's cold out here today. Everything's dying. Tomato plants gone. Fruits and veggies gone. But the Minchie dogs is out here still. For years and years and years, I keep saying. Chihuahuas lived in the cold, lived in the heat. They lived just about a little bit of everywhere. During the time they were making it this far. All they needed was somewhere to cuddle. See this hole right there? They would even dig holes. Had to put wire under the fence over there. Because they like to dig. And this has been for decades and centuries. These types of dogs have always liked it outside. And you, sometimes you can't control these dogs from being inside and out. Like that particular dog is just an outside dog. But this particular dog, she don't like to be outside like that. She likes her comfort, she's a girl, she don't have that high strong spirit like that boy dog got. She likes to just sit in her cage, she keep her food to herself, everything's to herself. You can't usually, a lot of people say you can train these dogs. Some of these dogs, when they come out, they are untrainable. And this particular dog right here loves kids. The one outside, he's already had three encounters with kids, so. I don't think he really likes kids like that. You know, she's a run around the house dog. Sometimes when you let her out, she won't even come out. Sometimes she will. She loves to play with my big dog. This was a dog that, like I said, I bought. My little boy outside, I made. I put his mother and father together and made him. And her, I bought. She's been timid ever since I had her. But she's friendly with my big dog. You know, these dogs can take cold. Don't let nobody tell you these dogs can't take no cold. It's just a few of them that can't. Super friendly. Just a complete house dog. A lot of people like big dogs. I like big dogs too. That's why I own one. But I also like little dogs. So I, I usually spend a lot of time talking about my little dogs because out of the two, I spend a whole lot of time with this little dog. When I walk outside to go get in the car, here comes the dog. This big dog, she just wants to eat and be petted, loved. She won't even go outside. That's the exotic bully. Whatever. I mean, I ain't going there, but. Yeah, uh, my little dogs is what I like to talk about. It's my little dogs. You know, this is a man pen crossed to a chihuahua. Both of them are females. The one outside was a boy. And this is his spot that he refuses to stay in. So he can't come in. Since you refuse to stay in, if I open that door right now, he's probably not even in the yard. He dug his way out. <laughs> For real. <laughs> I'm just telling the truth. The life of a little dog. Your big dog will stay in the yard. Your little dog will dig his way out. <laughs> Manchie line. 